We sold 41 aged final expense leads 100% over the phone in one week, and I'm going to show you how you can do it too. You can do it! But look, to do this and to accomplish this, I need you to commit to following the steps that I'm about to go over with you. If you want some serious profits and serious ROI on your lead investment, I need you to follow this step by step, refer to the other videos that I talk about in this video, dial in on your training and get ready to nail it because this is gonna be a huge opportunity for you to make some serious profits and some serious commissions in a short amount of time. Now look, when you get into final expense and final expense telesales specifically, I know how tough it can be. Most people transition to telesales from the field, you're a new agent, you may be kind of in a tough situation financially and you're trying to make it work for yourself, and those live transfers and those new leads, they look pretty darn expensive. Or you could be on the flip side and you could be an experienced agent, a veteran, trying to get into telesales and you got a stack of leads that you haven't sold and you're thinking, hey, maybe I can take advantage of these. Now I'm gonna be going over from an agency standpoint, kind of how we applied this to our business model, but you can take it and apply it to yourself as an individual agent, because I've been there. I've been in a situation where I need to make cash back on my investment in buying new leads, brand new expensive leads, it wasn't an option for me. I didn't have the money, my credit cards were maxed out. I was a new insurance agent. I was in debt, I was suffering, I was stressed out, and I was struggling. So I know what it's like if you're in that situation, okay? And if you're not, this is still gonna be a great video for you. So what we did is we had, we decided, hey, we've been buying leads for years and we have a ton of new leads that we're always giving our agents to sell. Just like most agents out there, they're buying new leads, they go out and sell them, they buy a new batch, they go out and sell them, they buy a new batch, they go out and sell them. So we decided, hey, we got these stacks of older leads, how can we make some money on these leads. Because at that point, it's pretty much free money for the agents and for the agency. So we said, hey, let's come up with a challenge to challenge agents to sell aged leads. So there are a few non-negotiables here, like I said, that you're gonna commit to. First off, since aged leads are cheaper, or maybe you already paid for them if you have a huge collection of leads, what I need you to do is commit right now that you're gonna put in a ton of activity, okay? So you are saving money but you're going to have to cover that cost with action and an activity level. You're gonna to have to make a lot of phone calls and there's gonna be some follow-up involved. Lazy agents should probably stop watching this video right now if making a lot of phone calls isn't something you wanna do, but don't get into telesales if you don't wanna make a lot of phone calls. Don't worry though, you're not making these calls on your cell phone. You're going to be getting a CRM I prefer to use Vanilla Soft. You can get whatever CRM you want. I need to use Vanilla Soft. That's my favorite one. You can check out the description in the video to schedule a demo with Vanilla Soft, or you can just email me at jve at djve.com if you would like to schedule something with them and set up something with them. But you have to get a CRM. That is another non-negotiable because you need to have a, a way to call these leads fast. Vanilla Soft is only like 100 bucks a month or so, maybe it's a little, a little more than 100 bucks a month. So if you make one sale, then you are paying for the CRM several times over. But what this is gonna allow you to do is click to call through your leads. All you gotta do is click the mouse to call through your leads instead of typing in each number and hitting it. You can call three to four times the amount of people in a day that you can, on, in the CRM that you can call in your phone. Next, you gotta get a bunch of aged leads. So you could fall into a few different categories here. You could fall into the category of, I'm an experienced agent, I've been doing this a while, I have a ton of leads that, I, that, have been, that I've bought before, and I haven't sold them all. So if that's the case, what you gotta do is get those leads, put them into one master spreadsheet, and upload them into your CRM so that you're gonna have all those leads to call through. The other scenario is that you're a brand new agent and you don't have a ton of leads. So what I want you to do is go out and buy aged final expense leads. I have a few different sources that you can use. You can reach out to me at jve at djve.com or you may have your own aged final expense lead source that you can go through. You can contact most lead vendors and just say, hey, I wanna buy some aged leads and see who's gonna give you the best price on them. You wanna buy a couple hundred of them. You can usually get them for like, you know, a dollar or like, or, or two or three, upload them into your CRM. Yes, it's gonna be a financial investment, 
but it's much lower than buying brand new leads, <laughs> you're gonna upload those into the CRM. I highly recommend telemarketing callback leads if you're calling age leads. However, you can go with Facebook leads. They may be cheaper, they may be more readily available, but I recommend telemarketing callback leads if you're selling over the phone. Find a vendor that'll sell you some older telemarketing callback leads. You're also gonna wanna get a headset for your computer. You can get one at Best Buy for 20 bucks. Check out my video in the description on my favorite headsets for final expense telesales. This is the one I use right here. It's 300 bucks if you don't wanna spend that much money. Check out the other one in the video. It's only 20 bucks at Best Buy. Does the same thing. Next, I need you to email me and ask me for my script, okay? So I know what works for me and what works for my agents. And I know that script works. So I need you to email me and get a copy of it and commit to learning it and role play and practice with yourself and get that bad boy down and master the rebuttals and the, the objection handling that I cover in some of my other videos on handling objections through telesales. So you have to get these objections down. Now, the most important thing is to master the greeting. So when you're calling age leads, you have to nail your greeting because they're gonna be a little bit more meh. The wall's gonna be up a little bit more because it happened a long time ago. They may not remember, okay? And you also have to get very good at relationship building really fast. So this comes down to making people laugh and then sharing a story that people can relate to, okay? So I want you to master your greeting. You have to have enthusiasm, energy, and excitement when you call B leads. You wanna be knocking these people out of their chair with your energy and your enthusiasm to get them to want to talk to you. Insurance is not interesting, you need to be interesting. So use that energy to keep them on the phone with you. And then number two, when you get into the fact finding part of the script, you're going to want to share stories with them, ask them questions about what they do for fun, their family, where they live, their grandkids, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Share something that you can relate about yourself to those answers, show empathy and show hope and give them some praise and build a relationship because you have to earn these people's trust, okay? Because like I said, the guard is a little higher on an age lead because they don't remember doing it, it was a while back, or they do remember, but they feel like no one followed up with them, or they already purchased insurance so they have trust with someone else. So you have to build that trust and build that credibility very quickly. You have to do it in the first five to 10 minutes of the phone call, and you do that through enthusiasm, energy, excitement, sounding like you know what you're talking about, handling any pushback that they give you, and also building a relationship through the sharing of stories and showing them empathy, praise, and hope. Now, you wanna call each of these leads that you upload into the CRM. I don't know how many that you're gonna have. I recommend getting to having at least a couple hundred. You're gonna to wanna to call them in the morning, the afternoon, in the evening. So you can usually program your CRM, at least I can know you, you can program VanillaSoft so that it will allow you to call every lead, every a lead every four hours. It'll put it at the back of the line to be called every four hours. So if you upload a couple hundred leads in there, I mean, you're gonna be, you may not call them all a couple times a day, uh, especially if you're going through presentations, but you, bottom line, you wanna be, you wanna call your leads as much as you can. I recommend triple dialing everybody, meaning you call, it goes to voicemail, hang up. Call, it goes to voicemail, hang up. Call, it goes to voicemail, hang up. That's three times in a row you call them before moving on to the next lead, okay? You wanna be making a few hundred phone calls a day. I recommend 300 phone calls a day or seven to eight presentations every single day. If your energy enthusiasm and what I talked about in that stuff is down pat, then you will be able to get through that many presentations with people throughout the day. If I was a new lead and a new agent and I bought 100 leads, I would say, okay, I'm going to program the CRM and the company VanillaSoft can help you with this. I'm gonna program the CRM so that every four hours, I have the ability to call that lead again. It's gonna be the next one that comes up in my call queue unless there's one that comes up that I haven't called yet. Okay, so bottom line, you're gonna to have to have activity be super high. You're gonna block off your day. 9 a.m. is when you can legally start calling, 9 a.m. local time. So I want you to be like from 9 a.m. to noon, I'm gonna just be a mad dialer. From 12 to 12.30, I'm gonna take my lunch or 12.15, it doesn't take me long to eat and then set up blocks of time from 12.30 to 4.30 or 12.30 to 3.30. I'm gonna be a mad dialer, I'm gonna take a 10 minute break, and then I'm going to dial until 8 or 9 p.m. and just completely be relentless on this phone and contact as many of these people as I can. So you have to commit to that energy level. That's exactly how we did it. Now look, the goal here is to make you as much profit on your lead investment as 
possible because leads are expensive. So what we did here is we traded the easy, more lay down brand new lead for a little bit more challenging of a lead that we're going to put time into. Because look, as a new agent, you got plenty of time, usually not much money. And most life insurance agents in general, they got plenty of time, not much money. So this is gonna help you maximize and capitalize on that investment to make some huge profit. Now, this is ultimately what we did. We took a bunch of the leads that we had already purchased that were aged leads, we scrubbed them against the do not call list, we uploaded them into our CRM, and we created a challenge bonus incentive for our agents to call aged leads. And we got 41 sales on aged leads in a week. It was pretty insane because just about everyone who called aged leads consistently made sales. And some of the agents didn't even call them, they just stayed on the new leads. But what it showed me is that it doesn't matter. The, the lead doesn't know if they're an old lead or not. And it has nothing to do with the lead itself. It has to do with how good are you as an agent. So I'm telling you, when you apply these steps and you start cranking out and busting out sales on age leads at high volume, once you buy those new leads, you're gonna totally crush it. You're gonna be like a metamorphosis from like a caterpillar to a beautiful butterfly that sells final expense and you're gonna see some pretty amazing changes in yourself. So challenge yourself with this. Get a bunch of age leads, get a CRM, upload them into the CRM, use my script, use my training. You're gonna be able to make a ton of sales and you're gonna be able to generate profit for yourself pretty quickly. Because look, the, the lead doesn't know it's an old lead. You're the only one that knows it's an old lead. Okay, so keep that in mind. Don't let, don't psych yourself out. I want you to track all your activity. I need you to do this right here. I need you to track your activity every single day. It's easiest to do through the CRM. So I need you to track how many calls you're making, how many presentations you made, how many sales you made, and then what your AP was on those sales. And when you divide your AP by how many calls you made and how many presentations you made, you can find your AP per dial, AP per presentation, you can extrapolate out from that by working backwards on the math how much money you wanna make. So you need to commit to minimum. You have to hit you have to hit one of these targets. You want to make 300 calls every day while you're doing this or have seven presentations every single day or two sales every single day. Those are minimum. 300 calls, seven presentations or two sales. I want you to set those as a non-negotiable minimum for activity for yourself. And you know that if you did one of those things, then you check your day off as done. This is gonna take a lot of effort, but look, don't get into telesales if you're not trying to work hard. The bottom line is this. If you don't have the money to invest in new leads, invest in age leads, and then invest the time that you're gonna sacrifice for the money so that later on, and you're, as you ex become more experienced as an agent, you'll be able to afford to buy those brand new leads and save yourself a little bit more time. Thank you guys. I hope you found value in this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe.